What is up guys, Julius here, and today I'm going to make a tutorial on how to make uh, some quick drawing animations with the paint bucket effect in Premiere Pro, similar to what you see in Scribble music videos. Let's take a look at the effect. Pretty cool, right? And it is actually very simple to make. Right here in my premiere, I have a clip of a girl dancing, as you can see. Nothing really special about that. So the first thing you want to do to get this scribble effect that I just showed you is search for an effect called paint bucket, like that, and take the effect and drag that onto your clip. Basically what this will do is it will select the point and it will kind of fill it in like a paint bucket if it's like similar texture and also out to the edges. So yeah, you, you basically know this maybe from paint uh, sort of shop or something like that. Basically what you want to do is change this stroke type from anti alias into stroke. That means it will only like highlight the edges. And what I'm going to do now is maybe move the fill point a little bit so we get it on her shirt. That looks nice. If you change the tolerance, it's basically just how much it's like gonna go out the stroke. Kind of like something like uh, this, 86. It doesn't really matter that much. The stroke width is basically just the width of the stroke. So one, it's a very like thin stroke. Five, a little bit more of a thick stroke, but I kind of maybe like something like two. Next thing we're gonna do is change the color to something else I like. I think I kinda wanna go with orange strokes. And I think I want to keyframe it from the start of the clip to the end of the clip. So it transitions maybe from orange to this blue. I think it could look pretty cool. Yep, and the next thing I'm going to do is use the blending mode color dutch. Yeah, that looks kind of cool. Basically, I'm not too sure what this does. You can play around with the effects, see what you like. It also looks kind of cool. It does like sort of gradient, hard light. No. Lighten, no. I kind of like the color dutch that I landed on. So let's see how it looks. That looks cool, and I'm happy with that. It was a short tutorial today, because uh, I have something I gotta do. But anyways, if you uh, you learned something new, please hit the subscribe button, and uh, hit the like button if you want to. It, uh, you don't have to, but it is really motivating to know if I helped you. And uh, please let me know in the comments which type of tutorial you would like to see next, so I have an idea what you would like to see. But if not, I'll just, uh, I have some ideas myself that I want to put out. But uh, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye.